I guess why I chose the boardroom school is where I'll start. So I think because it's such a practical and realistic time commitment, um, it's not overly daunting to go into it when you're busy with a career, with family and everything else. Um, I saw it as a great opportunity to meet other women that were there also to learn. And there were some really great women in our group, as I'm sure there will be in this group. Um, it's excellent value for money. Like the, the articles literally fill a lever arch folder. And I know this because somebody in our group printed them all off. Um, but you don't need to print them off. They're all in the portal. They're there to go. And there's a lot of the articles have further links to more articles. So you've got even more information. Um, the other thing, the other reason I picked this course was Margot herself. So um, she's got an amazing wealth of knowledge. She was very generous with her time. I had specifics to one of my board specific questions and, and Margot made the time for me during the course to catch up one-on-one -on -one and just talk through some of those because I actually took on a, a second board in the middle of doing the boardroom school uh, which was a sporting board and, and so Margot's insights to help me kind of get the lay of the land and understand all the acronyms and all the different bits and pieces was fantastic so I think and Margo, you may remember this from the first session the fundamental question I think I wanted answered is is my board normal um <laughs> turns out it's as normal as any other yeah yeah, yeah they all have this strangeness they do they do ruth they're yeah. all they're all unique to themselves I'm that's sure. right yeah but yeah and i i wanted to get out of it a better understanding of the roles and responsibilities because i recently joined one board was on the way to getting a second one uh, in volunteer positions and understand how to deal with conflicts and the risks in a boardroom and handle disputes um, when I read literally the module headings for this course, it, it was a no brainer for me for, for what I wanted to learn and get out of it. And I got all of that. I got insights and information on all of that. And then, like I said, access to a great network of people, including Margot, um, specific advice on my particular problems that I needed help with. Um, and, you know, just, I gained, I gained a lot more confidence in the boardroom. So it's, Margot said it during the course, it's, your opinion matters and it is relevant. One member, one vote. And that made me really think, and I have probably become more, not, not vocal, that's probably the wrong word, but more involved and engaged in my boards because of that, because I need to back myself more because I know more than I think I do. So I, I love that it was a small group. That was another thing for me because everybody gets a chance to participate and it's not so overwhelming because there's so many people there. Um, I'd encourage you to, to sign up and if you do try and get to everyone I know it's difficult when you've got a busy working life but just the the value from the live sessions rather than listening to the recordings is just amazing so a couple of our sessions run over by a few minutes just because the conversation was so good and so engaging and I think just if you can give yourself that little buffer at the end of 15 minutes just so you've got the time to sit and, and get as much out of it as you possibly can then that, that's fantastic. It's, I would recommend it to anybody to sign up straight away.